You know, Kim, when people talk about the great culinary trails around the world, not too often do they put Ireland on the top of the yeah. list, but this region in Ireland is as good as it gets. It's known as the Mourne region. There's mountains, wonderful countryside, and the best primary producers in all of Europe are here. Oh, well, the only real way to test that out is to take a food tour. If you're looking for a few days' indulgence, sampling the local artisan food whilst riding a bike, well, Andrew Porter has got us sorted out. He's given us a bike here. Now, I'm looking for Trev. Now, I'm not sure whether he's gone, but I've got a special... <laughs> All right, Kimbo, listen, mate. Let's go! Come on! Nice bike. Whether you take the electric bike like Kim or the pedal power like me, it doesn't matter because it's all downhill. There are many routes you can choose, and the region is alive with many of the local food producers, like the Butter Company, Oyster Farms, and Free Range Chicken Farms. The journey is all up to you. The heather is in full bloom at the moment, and it looks amazing. It's been a great year for its flowering, which has other benefits along the food trail journey. Well, Kimbo, this has got to be a highlight for me. We're at the halfway point, so six miles down the hill, and we've stopped at Enniskeen Country House Hotel. Now, their high teas are so famous. There's all sorts of goodies here, but this honey, remember we talked about the honey before? Well, you can't get more local than this honey. It's actually made from two types of heather. There's the Bell and Ling heather, and they're just in this region here. And the other thing, too, is it's been four years since the bees have been able to take the pollen from that and the nectar the from honey. that. Yeah. Would you like some more tea? Oh, lovely. Thank you. Okay. Wonderful. The journey continues into the town of Newcastle, which is a coastal retreat for people from Dublin and Belfast who visit during the summer months. And the weather this time of year is simply incredible. A good excuse for an ice cream, and there's a shop here that's got a reputation that spans all of Ireland. Hello. Hello, welcome to Graham's. Thank, Thank you. you very much. We're very excited. We've heard this is the best ice cream in all of Ireland. I hope so too. I hope you think so. Why yeah. is it so good? I think it's so good because it's local, mm -hmm. uh, it's handmade, it's not mass produced. <laughs> now what are you famous for? What's your most famous I ice cream? I would say we're most known for our vanilla, which we've been making for over 30 years. Right, it's been okay. handed on through two different families and we're now the second generation selling it. Okay. That looks fantastic. Wow. There you go. I hope you enjoy it. Thank, Thank you very much. much. Hey, hey. Man, that was great fun. A gentle ride in the countryside. Well, it really was for you, because you're on the electric bike. <laughs> I know. But you know what? Uh, even this one, there's not too many rises up and down. The gearing makes it just so easy. Yeah. Great food. Yep. Unbelievable view. Well, what look about the that. stonework, the heather? Uh, look, for more information on what we've done and what you could be doing, go to our website.